Hello and welcome back. Episode, I think, three or four of Skaven Legendary Play. We're, we're right where we left off. The plan was to declare war on the last defenders, thereby starting either we lose this campaign or we win this campaign. Or at least... Okay, the option is we either lose this campaign or we can stick to it a little bit longer until the next time we might lose this campaign, which is kind of how it goes in the early game of Legendary, so... We're going to see how that goes. Now, I've thought about it, and I'm still going to go through with the plan. These guys are going to declare war, war on us anyway, so we might as well have an ally who can have his own armies. What is that? Oh, okay. Where are you, last defenders? We're going to declare war on them. They don't have any allies for now, so that's good. And my plan was to march right into them, right next to their city. Hopefully that gives us... Uh, oh, I can't quite march. Let's do it anyway, as close as we can get. If our ally has any sense, he'll attack and we can join him. If he has any sense whatsoever. Can we get a little bit, a little bit closer? Okay, that's as good as we can get. Let's see what happens. Well, that didn't go according to plan, did it? Okay, we're in trouble here. We're in trouble. So we got to fight off all these lizard men. And we only have one stack. Euromastix and Mook Wallen. So Krotgar isn't here. If we lose, we have to go back home and this settlement that we're trying to protect is still a buffer. So if we lose, it's not the end of the world. But I don't want to lose. Let's let's pay. Screw it. Let's pay all the food we want. As many rats as we can get in on this one. This is this is the critical moment. The big problem here is that we're starting tired. That is a big problem for us, and we can't run. So maybe this was a big mistake. We'll find out. Okay, good news, we have the hill. That is exceptionally good news. Let's carefully survey this battle. The odds are against us, but I'm not, I'm not gonna act like I'm gonna lose this one. I think, I think we can win this one if we're careful and clever. We have a lot of storm vermin halberds that should do lots of damage. They have great leadership, especially when they're next to Queek. Oh, okay. So I think we're going to fight. I hate fighting in forests. But if they have like really like cold ones and stuff, that's going to be our advantage. But the visibility in forests is just awful. So let's go ahead and deploy. Let's kind of use this as a natural barrier to our flank. Like I'm going to do this. Let's have a lot of a very heavy, deadly group of storm vermin on the flanks. Like so. I think that flank's a little heavy. Let's, let's do something like this so we have a little bit of reinforcements to the center if we need it. These these one will be a little bit more in the center. They'll, they'll kind of hang out with Queek, I think, as like a bodyguard. 
our warp fire throwers are gonna have a lot of trouble in this battle, which is unfortunate. I think what they'll do is kind of hang out here. And the rat ogres will also be part of the center line where the fighting is gonna be probably at its worst. And for now, I think I'm just going to group all of them in case we have to make any adjustments. But I expect as the battle progresses, uh, this is it's going to turn into a mess. A battle like this is going to turn into a massive mess. Probably with a central fight towards the end where everyone's desperately trying to win the, the uh, morale war. So I think we're ready. Let's wait for them to come to us because we're all tired. So by the time they get here, hopefully we'll be more rested, which is going to give us an edge. Or at least not such a penalty. I can't get any closer be because it's legendary, so I'm just going to turn up the speed here and we're going to watch them rally together and come at us. What's this? Skink skirmishers? Oh, these skirmishers are right on top of us. Can we hit them? Let's see. The skinks are doing terrible, terrible work. I'm half tempted to just let them run out of ammo, really. Where's... Okay. Let's see if we can... Get a little bit closer to these skinks and hit them with the warp fires. Actually, no, I don't want to do that. It's a waste of it's a waste of the ammo we're gonna desperately need later. Where's our the? Okay, these guys are still way behind. What we're gonna do is come at them like this. I hope this is worth a rat spawn. Or maybe I'm faster than them? It seems unlikely. Let's see if we can catch those guys. And wrap around. I don't want to waste my my spawns on something stupid like skinks. There we go, we got him. The Lizardmen are pretty slow, I believe, so it's going to take them a little while to get to us. More skirmishers are on the scene. Let's just go back. They're going to they're gonna skirmish the hell out of us. I don't want to deal with it. We're just going to take some losses, but I mean... Yeah, they baited me into it and I fell for it. I didn't know there was this many. We'll just use our shields to to mitigate the damage. I want our Skaven shields. They block 35% of the small arms fire. That's not very good. Can't do anything about it. How are we doing as far as rest goes? We're still tired. Oh, that's... I wonder if you just can't get any better than tired. That would be super unfortunate. Yep, the skinks are just using their ammo. It's better that they use it on us now instead of when we're fighting because it's poisonous, I believe. Yeah, we're in the forest. We have shields. They're, they're not... They're just tickling us, really. Yep, those skinks, or <laughs> skanks, those skinks ran out of ammo. These ones, I don't know, what are they doing? Shooting my rat oak? I can't even tell what they're shooting because they're doing so bad. It looks like we're capped on tired. I, I We would definitely be getting more fatigue by now, but that's not going to be the case, it looks like. Very unfortunate. 
We've spotted something. Oh, they've spotted us, but we haven't seen them yet because they're lizardmen. Oh, looks like the skinks are, are fighting us. That's fine. Clan rats will screw them up pretty bad. Let's pull back here with the clan rats. Oh, those kinks have javelins. Okay, now we're now we're here. We're getting started here. Let's get everyone in. It's time to fight. Where's their leader? Their leader's over there, so we're gonna have to redeploy. Let's get in. We've got skinks, skinks, Soros warriors. Let's let's see if we can get in the flanks here a little bit. Actually, with everyone. I don't care about the skinks. I hate fighting in forests. You can never tell what's going on. Let's see if we can hit those guys. Queek, time to get in there. Let's start dropping rats. Big question I have. Do these rats have the bonuses? No, they don't. Oh, wait. I don't I don't think they get the bonuses from from Queek's abilities. Let's get these warp fire throwers over here. Let's get everyone to pile into the flank. How are we doing over here? It's hard to tell. It's like nighttime and in the forest. The storm vermin are hanging in there like crazy good. Like crazy good. They're doing very good. Let's keep these guys moving around. Look how densely packed we're tight. We're, we're packed in here. That's good. Queek is rocking this guy, I think. Come on, Queek. Take him on. Let's... Where do we Where do we need some, some guys? Let's do it right here. Let's see if we can route these, these uh, Saurus by, by getting them surrounded. Like so. Good. Come on, guys. We're almost there. We are almost there. This is going to be incredibly painful. This is going to win us the battle right here, I think. If, if we win this battle, it'll be because of this. We're here. We are here. Do it, guys. Let her rip. Let her rip. Oh, my gosh. How does that feel? Very good. Queek, you got to get in there, buddy. You got to get in there. Over here, we're doing okay. Come on, guys. Follow it up. Follow it up. We're, we're hosing these guys down really bad. Let's get make sure they're targeting like the Saurus and stuff, not our own guys. We're doing okay in there. We're doing... I, I can't tell how we're doing. I, I can't. Skink skirmishers. I don't know what they're doing. They might be trying to shut down the warp fire throwers. I hope not. They are doing some some great damage over there. Let's see if we can reinforce. We want to make sure we hold these guys down. Queek, where are you? Come on, Queek. Do some damage. Oh, this. okay, the skinks got on us. I thought they might do that. Can we get uh, some clan rats over here, please? Get some clan rats over here, please. We need the help. Oh, dear. Yep, the skinks have found something to do. I I, I was thinking on it, but and I should have, but I didn't use a menace blow to protect our warp fire throwers. Can I get even more in the rear and just double down? We're, we're very close to another spawning. Let's do it. Come on, guys. Save the warp fire throwers. Come on. Okay, we're here. Let's let's roast them. Who's not fighting? You, not a, No one over here is fighting? Come on, guys. Get in there. Yep, we're giving it to them good. What are these? Source warriors? Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Get out of there. Skirmish mode. Run. Who's, is anyone not fighting? You guys. Get back in there. Oh, our warp fire throwers just got butchered. Very badly. 
That's too bad. But they, they did a, a pretty good job while it lasted. What are we doing in here? Our storm vermin are confident, but not doing too well. What I want to do is I want to make sure we get this flank. If we can handle this and roll up their line, we'll win. We just got to get out of here. We got to get out of here. Queek is in. Queek isn't doing too good. Let's see if we can get him out of that mess. Come on, Queek. Let's get out of there. Good. Okay. Let's keep him in reserves a little bit. Is anyone not fighting? We have we have so many storm vermin right here. It's a tr it's an issue. These clan rats are are taking down the source. Let's see if we can sneak around and get these guys in the rear. How are we doing in here? We just have a lot of storm vermin and they're they're doing work. They're doing work, but it's not enough. Over here, well, it's not enough here either. Let's see if we can get another rear charge. Come on guys, get in there. Boy, the Saurus have incredibly good leadership, I'm guessing. Can't quite tell. Oh, there we go. They have awful leadership, but they, I don't know, they just don't run? Yeah, I guess they don't run. That's scary. Mukwalan is in there fighting, I think. Let's see. Yep. Let's, let's see if we can get Queek to kill one last hero. That's not looking good in there. It's not looking good. We gotta get some rear charges in here. Come on, Queek, get in there. Let's get some rear charges. Maybe we can break their morale a little bit. Boy, Lizardman is just no joke. Keep in mind, we're trying to fight these guys while we're, like, exhausted. Whoop. Whoopsie. We're trying to fight these guys while we're exhausted. They're not exhausted yet. Probably. Queek is in here. He's fighting Mukwalan. Hopefully he wins. If he doesn't, we lose. We're having some morale trouble over here. Let's, let's double down. We gotta get this flank. We gotta get this flank under control. If we can, we can hit these guys. After we hit those guys, we can hit these guys. And then we're and then we're good. Queek and Mukulon still fighting it out. Still fighting it out. Rat ogres. Come on, guys. Get in there. Oh, they have sh You know what? Rat ogres, get over here. That's what we want to do. We got him. We got him. We got the hero. There, we've, we've got some shattered units over here. Oh yes, that's exactly what we needed. Good job, Queek. Good job, Queek. We, we might win this one. We might win this one, we're not sure yet. We're not sure yet. Let's, un let's unlock here, it's, it's getting weird on us. Let's see if we can get everyone over here. Yeah, we're going to win this. I'm pretty sure we're going to win this. Everyone in. Everyone in. Queek, just stand around. Use your leadership to boost everyone. Where can we use some more rats? Let's uh, let's put some rats in here. Their morale's wavering a bit. Let's see if we can't make it waver a little bit more. Great. We've got some broken Saurus over here. Take them down. Take them down. Let's uh, let's follow up over here now. These Saurus might come back, so... Let's see. Queek, you hang out in the back. Let's see. 16 Storm Vermin. Make sure those guys keep running. You guys make sure those guys keep running, please. One more spawning of the Menace below. Oh, boy. This is really coming down to it. This is coming down. Storm Vermin. Come on, guys. Get in there. Help out. Is anyone else not fighting? Follow up. 
one more spawn. These guys are right about to break. Let's see if we can do it. Come on, get, get them in the rear. Yeah. These guys are running. Those guys are running. These guys are running. Oh, this is it. We win. That's it. That is why I love this game. Battles like this are, are where this game is at. It's battles like this. Lots of loot. We desperately needed that. Not quite a level, but that's okay. Well, we lost our warp fire throwers. And I'm still going to maintain that their salvos did so much damage that it helped swing that flank that we eventually overwhelmed and turned on the rest of them. So they fought well. We're going to pick up some more as soon as we are technologically able. And we lost some clan rats with shields. Let's uh, screw those guys. I'm going to go ahead and enslave them. Let's get that leadership bonus. Yep, they're going to leave. That didn't quite work out for you guys, did it? Okay, the Fortress of Dawn has been defeated. That's good. We've killed a thousand enemies in battle. That's good. We kill the hero, great. Carry out a hero action. Well, we don't have a hero yet. Plus two for clan rat unit recruits. Income from post-battle loot, good. Capture the golden tower. That, I don't imagine that happening in 25 turns, but we'll see what can happen. Okay. I'm going to push our luck. First of all, now now we're not tired at the start of a battle. Imagine how that battle would have went if we weren't exhausted the entire time. Let's 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 get them. Let's follow up. They can't run and if we kill them, it's going to set them back so far. Time for things to die, die. Yeah. That's that's a big setback for them. No question whatsoever. We got a bunch of cash out of it. We got a level. That's great. Another hero down. And I'm going to go for life is very cheap because plus 20% casualty replenishment rate is, is, it's just incredible. That's what that is. It's just incredible. Big question right now, and do I want to push my luck even further and fight those guys? First of all, let's take a look at the damage we did. The last defenders were strength one in the world. Now they're strength 28. That hurt. That hurt really bad. I think if this was like single player, I'd probably just jump in there and and not even care if I lost. But I think I'm going to I think I'm going to hold back. We're going to lick our wounds and wait for them to come at us again or I mean it looks like we might even be able to lick our wounds faster than they can. I'm going to force march all the way home cuz we have to get all the way out here in order to start um, rebuilding our clan rats. Let's... We have plenty of money now, so let's upgrade Tor Serpentar. I'm probably going to get a barracks here just to get some clan rats while... Um, so I don't have to go all the way home to replenish like our crappy units. 
That's probably going to be a good idea. In here, Dawn's Light has finally been built. Let's go ahead, since we have the money, let's go ahead and get some docks. It's going to increase our growth and our income. The income is going to be important so that we can field more stuff. Let's go with that upgrade and with that upgrade. All right, we spent all our money. Great. Uh, I don't care about that. I'm not, I'm going to hold off on that until we're bloody rich. Technology and more casualty replenishment rate or melee attack for clan rats. Let's go with the melee attack for the clan rats. That's going to be so nice. We could also get scavenging runs for the armor too. Our clan rats are actually going to be pretty beefy. Yeah. No, I'm looking forward to that. Okay. By the way, the storm vermin, they did incredible during that battle. Their staying power was something something to speak of, really. Scrag hole, no, I don't want to upgrade you. We're pretty much just going to wait, gather up our money and spend it when we're in range and hopefully we can be back in time before the next incursion. Maybe these guys will even take back Teotihuacan because we hit them so hard. I mean, we hit them hard. That was a crushing defeat for them. And you know, I think I think that's probably the end of this episode. Um yeah, a big old battle that that probably took long enough. And uh, yeah, next episode we're going to re replenish and maybe we could take Teotihuacan, Serpent Coast, and Golden Tower depending on how badly they've been beaten back. So I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you in the next one.